Coronation Street revisits Bethany Platt's dark storyline next week, as Nathan Curtis' sidekick Mel McGuire makes a surprise reappearance. Bethany Lucy Fallon is currently facing an anxious wait for Nathan to stand trial, after he and his accomplice Neil Clifton were both arrested for their roles in her grooming ordeal. Life should be looking up for Bethany next week, when her Greek grandmother Audrey Roberts Sue Nichols offers her an apprenticeship as a beautician at the salon. Sadly, with her self-esteem still low, Bethany is unsure whether she has what it takes. Advertisement continue reading Bella Thiers also the possibility of new romance on the horizon, when Craig Tinker's loved ones start encouraging him to ask Bethany out, having spotted the pair's close bond. However, everything is thrown up in the air for Bethany, when Mel turns up on the street and finally explains herself, revealing how she was one of Nathan's first victims. Mel won't testify against Nathan in court because she fears for her life, but she tries to get Bethany to understand why she's so unwilling to help. Determined not to give up so easily, Bethany tells her mom Sarah that they need to get Mel on their side to stand any chance of seeing justice served. In the end, the Platts invite Mel to stay the night in the hope of changing her mind, but are they being too trusting here is Mel really being honest about the reasons for her sudden arrival advertisement continue reading Bello Sonia Ibrahim, who plays Mel, revealed I was very happy when I heard that Mel would be coming back to the street, but I knew that there would be some kind of intention behind it for Mel. But even though there is a reason why she is back, it's good that all of Mel's story comes out and the Platts get to know everything about her. Mel has been homeless for a while, so when she sees Bethany, she's desperate to speak to her. Bethany knows what Mel has done, so obviously she doesn't like her, and she wants to phone the police, but Mel manages to persuade her to invite her into the Platts to hear her side of the story. Bethany is trying to continuously open Mel's eyes to how brainwashed she is. Bethany keeps asking her to come to court because she needs her help. Laura is not a reliable witness and Mel knows more, so she can help to put Nathan away. Asked how Mel reacts to that, Sonia replied definitely deep down Mel knows that it's right and that she should do it. There's always the tone fro in her mind of whether she should go to court, but that little voice in her head, which is Nathan, is just niggling away at her, saying no, do what I want, do what I want at first Bethany doesn't know what Mel has been through and tells Mel not to play the victim. So that's when Mel says she's had it worse. She says that she's taken beatings for Bethany and explains she was Nathan's first with all this stuff, and it just escalated. Mel still thinks that she's his one true love. She's been through a lot, a lot more than anyone realizes. Coronation Street airs these scenes on Wednesday, September 27 at 7.30 p.m. and 8.30 p.m. on ITV.FOR More information on the National Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Children and how they can help you or someone who you know is in need, please click here. Rape Crisis England and Wales works towards the elimination of sexual violence. If you have been affected by the issues raised in Bethany's storyline, you can access more information on their website or by calling the National Rape Crisis Helpline on 0808002999. Rape Crisis Scotland's helpline number is 0808801030. Readers in the US are encouraged to contact Rain or the National Sexual Assault Hotline on 8006564673. Read more news, spoilers and gossip on our Coronation Street home page and up to the Minute Soaps News, spoilers and gossip on your social feeds just hit like on our Digital Spy Soaps Facebook page and follow on our at Soap Scoop Twitter account. Digital Spy Soap Scoop video, hit play below for all the latest Coronation Street gossip as Maria tries to ruin Eva's wedding day and Michelle's stalker is exposed.